hook because this is a hook only design um rubber bands today for the border i'm going to use white for the two inside colors i will be using um pink and teal and i will be using a colored c clip in the color of white So yeah, everything you see here is from the Rainbow and Webster. Without further ado, let's get started. You're going to take your border color and make a cat band on your hook. Then you're going to take another border color and then slide it through the cat band. And then you're going to take another border color and slide it through here, through one side of the bracelet just like that then you're going to carefully flip this around by pinching the bands and turning it around just like this and then sorry my cat ran okay you're going to slide a band through what the other side of the um white just like this so then you are going to flip i mean pull one side over the other in the middle just like this so it's basically the cheval share or something by late loomer then you are going to take a um inside color band which i'm using pink first and you're going to slide it through the first two bands these two bands so just like this then you're going to flip this over again just flip it over just like this now you're going to take another border band and you're going to slide it through these two leftover white or border band, whatever color you're using for the border. Just like this. And um, now this is where like the actual pattern starts. So now you're going to take another border color and just put it on the tip of your hook. Just like this. Then you're going to take the outside two which are the colored bands and not your border bands. And you're gonna slide them onto this band, just like this. Take it and slide it onto there, just like that. Now you're gonna carefully flip it over once more. And then you're gonna take a border band again and then slide it through these two first bands. There won't be any more folding or anything like that. Just like that. Then you're gonna flip it over again. There's a lot of flipping and hook only bracelets, so yeah. Then you're going to take your next band, which for me is teal, oops. And you're gonna slide it through the first two bands, just like this. Okay, so now, just like this, you're gonna flip it over again. No, we won't be adding any more bands. Well, kind of. So now we should have the color band on this side and then the border bands like in an L shape. Now we're gonna take a border band again and repeat the pattern that we did with the pink right here. But we're gonna do it with this side. And you're gonna pull, 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 pull this, these two, onto this this band just like this now you're gonna flip it over again just like this so you're basically gonna repeat this pattern all the way to the end show you one last time and you want to do it so that it's like in a zigzag like that so 
and a trick to remember is like once you apply once you fold over the um colored band and you pull the border band the leftover two bands that are on your hook that aren't the border bands i guess um you slide a band through those with the border color and like the way it's flipped over the way it's like flipped over that's the side you're gonna put the band on like it's pointing this way so i'm gonna slide my colored band on to this band just like that just like that and now you're going to grab your band and then slide it through oops slide it through these two see it's actually going in the right pattern so you're going to repeat this all the way until you're done and i'll show you how to end this off so i'll be right back to show you how to end this so I'm about to finish it off, so I'm up to the part where I'm about to flip it around. Well, I am going to flip it around right now. And I'm about to apply the last two bands. So when you're about to finish like this, you're going to take your band and then do the regular hooking process. Just like this, flipping the band onto that band. But now you're going to take your um, border band again. And then slide it through everything, just like that. And then you're going to carefully take it off your hook and put a C-clip on there. Okay, so now we just have to put the ends together. Well, I hope you guys liked this tutorial. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up. And if you make this bracelet, please hashtag it to hashtag HQCrafts and hashtag live underscore love underscore loom. And I'll put... Our hashtags and our usernames are right here. And tag us in the photo. And yeah, I hope you guys like this tutorial. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.